Hello there, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me back here in Old World Blues. Now, this is not where we left off yesterday with the Pale Folk. Uh, I basically had to replay the yesterday's video off-screen just because I made a mistake uh, selecting focuses and getting these focuses done as fast as possible. But as you can see, we have Vault City back, and actually I built my armies quite a bit more, a little bit more industry knowing that we know what to do. Uh, I've cored off, mo actually, I cored all of the, well, holy crap, I cored this area of Vault City. I cored all of it. And then I took out the Pale Folk, not the Pale Folk, the Cyclops Tribes again. I've cored everything but Elko. But this, uh, this isn't our cores now? What the heck? Regardless. Um, here's the deal. So I release him as a puppet. They're still led by Festus, And a couple comments to get through. So you guys thought that if we release them as a puppet, release Vault City, and they're a puppet now, this would automatically bypass like the requirements, or we get through the requirements for doing Vault Tech Calling. As well as business as usual, because you guys left a comment saying that you know what we don't like burn the city, we should do we are the overseer now. So uh, let's see new directions. Actually, I didn't. Did it do, uh, we weren't able to take this one, so we're still limited. So here's what we're gonna do. Even though this is early on in the video, I'm gonna go off screen. I'm gonna auto complete the focuses that say Vault City is giving us a hard choice because I'm not gonna do this one yet because we wanna do this together, and I'll also do business as usual as well as new directions. Because we can't go down that path. Um, oh, my, ooh, we might even, but ooh, we can't do this either. Vault City conquered, or as well as working with Vault City. So I'm gonna go ahead and get these done off screen. All right, my friends. So I have done it, and I've done all the focuses that require us to basically conquer Vault City or work with them, including Vault Tech calling, uh, exploit the countryside too, because you need to conquer them to get this one done. So get more weekly manpower and consumer goods. If you want to read this, go right ahead. I think I might have read this in the last video as well. So it is what it is. I also did business as usual. Uh, let's see. Full stockpiles, huh? That's kind of cool. So we don't have an immediate need to look for spare parts anymore. The rating business was pretty lucrative and other guards too. So why not continue with that? I've also done New Direction because, well, now that the, that the situ situation with Vault City is solved, we can now go New Directions with how to develop our forces. As well as Pale Folk Security. I think this one you have to do with, like, working with Vault City. Or we could have done, like, conquering Vault City. Regardless, we couldn't do it. So basically you had to use console commands to do this one. So, I had to do it. And also, I didn't even talk about this one, but we had to do this one because you had to be working with Vault City or conquer them, something like that. We still couldn't do it unless you use console commands so far. Our new allies have come through and sent us a fancy Vault-Tec branded fusion generator that they surprisingly had just lying around and were not using themselves. Time to replace our home brew one, which is great. And I also did this one, fresh meat, if you want to read about this. So basically, we got a thousand manpower, and that's how we're at four thousand right now. So, those are the ones we could take uh, that required us to basically use console commands to get through this, so. Uh, but we won. This was unexpected. Despite our willingness to fight Vault City, we really did not think we would actually win against them. Now, in addition to being able to decide our fate, we can decide theirs too, which would be great. And honestly, this looks really disgusting. I will re-annex them later. That was a comment from yesterday. Uh, just re-annex them later, you know. And I will. I totally will. But, because actually, I built them up. I built up Gecko. They have a lot more, uh, they should have a few more civilian factories, but a warning. Vault City figured out that we were ramping up arms production and stockpiling weapons, and official with a heavily armored entourage came to one of our tunnel entrances to speak to our leader. We denied them entry, claiming that nothing was going on. Despite looking visibly angry, the official called his men back and retreated to Vault City, saying that we can consider ourselves warned. We should tread carefully if we want to increase our production capability or be ready to deal with the consequences. What? There are puppets! What? Okay, but... I asked you guys yesterday, we really... Should we do burn the city? Or we have the overseer now? We kind of didn't get an option in the last video, even though I love more stability and war support. But, we're going to go We Are the Overseer now, because you guys recommended it, by overwhelming support, majority support. So, now that we have Vault City in the surrounding area under our thumb, we should see if there are some people who there we can conceive to fight for us. There are probably some who are not particularly happy about being ruled by Vault City, if we base it on our experience, of course. And we need more men to secure these lands better, which will be good. Hopefully we can get that done. I want to get through this part of the focus tree as fast as possible, just so that nothing bad happens again. So, like I said, this is not where we left off yesterday. So, Murtaugh decided to go to war with, I think, the Shoshone Nation, as well as the Crimson Acolytes. But now they're killing each other. As well as Lone Tree and the Lord's Anointed. Oh, they're, oh they were guaranteed. You guys are fighting Heaven's Gate and Murtaugh. Okay, so, hmm. Interesting. And also, I just got frag grenades just because... Flames, if we're, if we're like underground and we use flames, that might hurt our eyes. So if we're like attacking with explosives, that won't hurt our eyes as much. That's why I thought of that. So no more dynamite, just bigger explosives. What is that? Wait, hold on. 
Wait, why, why do we have that symbol there? I didn't get a company there that does that. Oh well. This is the weirdest campaign, or one of, a very weird campaign, where we saw Lone Trees going to town with uh, the Anointed, and Murtaugh smashing out, or smashing the Crimson Acolytes. Very weird. And also the Yakuza tribes are dead too, or territory. Take back the night. We got a second warning from Bolt City in the form of an attack on one of our tunnel entrances. Looks like they didn't take too well to refuse it to cease our activity, but we prepared for this. We will not bow down to them any longer. We did not survive for this long under all the hardships we endured to be slaves. We will fight and we will survive this too. I don't like where this is going or what it's sounding like, so I'm just going to do this real quick. Just real quick. I mean, there are puppets, so... I don't know. This this focus tree is a little screwy, we'll say. A little, a little screwy, so... And we lost a couple more factories. Oh, God. Yeah. Hmm. No national focus. Oh, what do they have? Because they're going to Google Conference something greater? What? Oh, no. You joined the Nevada Pact. How? Join the... That's why I want to puppet them, to be honest with you. An eye for an eye. Slack out stripes core territories. Yeah, go try to fight me. It's not going to work out well for you. Nevada Pact. Why? Are you kidding me? The Northern Mojave Pact. But the Nevada Pact? Oh, there goes New Reno, and they're trying to kill off a Antelope Tribe, so be it. Uh... Actually, can we core this area finally? I'll go. Yes, we can. Good. It's not much, but we'll take it. Uh... So let's get through this as fast as possible, so then I can start basically having to re-core Vault City. So, and then we'll see what happens, because I really built these guys up. I spent that extra political power to core everything again. And this is the way they treat us? No, no. That's disgusting. What the heck? <laughs> Hi, Chapel. Why? Oh, this is so bad. Look how... They're not going to have enough manpower for this. The Presbyter Anne? Eh, maybe they do have... So oh. Hmm? Hmm. Oh, there you go. It's going to be all over the place. Yeah, that was a bad idea for them. Standardized tools. Cool. And let's see. What else do we have that we need to do? 2279. Let's grab some refined tools. Refined tools are very good to use. Ooh, we need some more resources, too. Oh, we need more secretary. Oh, that's not good. We are the overseer now. And turn about us fair play. So we could have probably thought of this earlier, but seeing as how it was done to us. But one is always smarter in hindsight. We have a subject now. And what does that one... And what does one do to a subject? That's right. Taxes. Cool. Oh, look, we got these uh, divisions, too. You guys are 16 combat width. You yeah, actually have just the companies, huh? That's a little different. Actually, I'm going to put three over here. Because you never know if we have to go fight... Uh, these guys, the 80s, so you never know. Also, I did make these guys as fat as possible before we do that one focus. So, uh, all city mercenaries, film fighters. Yeah, doggos would be nice. I'm not even using riders yet. How much? Oh, we have some rider equipment. Just not bad. Okay, there you go. The, the 80s actually went to war with the white legs. Okay, that's a little different, but you know what? If we can get involved too, uh, yeah. So basically, this is where we picked up, kind of, of yesterday. Kind of. Kind of. Actually, did we do that? Yeah, we did. I uh, obviously cannot think right now, but whatever. Turn about is fair play. What else we making? Still getting some more army XP, which is nice. Do you guys have anything here? Yeah, I have a good feeling the Wild Legs are probably going to win before they kill all these guys off, but even then. Oh, the Wild Legs did cord New Canaan. White seals for white legs, huh? Yeah, they're looking kind of thick. You still have to be a puppet, right? No. You, okay, that was such a bad idea. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? We, we liberated you to get this done. No, we're still going to do this. We're still going to get through all of this. Come on. That's so stupid. That is... Mm, this focus tree, I swear to God, is not... Not quite right. <laughs> It's really not quite right, because I don't have to fight Vault City. I, I, core, I core all that stuff. Hmm. Hmm. That's going to make things a lot more difficult, then. Hmm. Because I, mean, I can't... I cannot fight New Reno right now. They're, they're way too strong. We have, like, 21 divisions max. You know, actually... If the White Legs take out the 80s and we can't go to them, I can go to Eastport and still annex them and take them out, as well as maybe even Murtaugh? Maybe? We'll see what happens. Hmm. Now, it is good. Oh, I guess the Western Brotherhood of Steel is fighting the NCR, but hmm, we'll see what happens too. Infiltration tactics are good. We just finished our land auction, which is awesome. I'm going to go and grab automation, which is good. 
Can I help out Vault City? We could get do some more army XP. Wow, army XP. Only one division? You know, we could try it, I guess. Quiet ones. I'm going to help them out because I want to... Because we're going to need them. In my mind, we're going to need them. Just because... I'm going to need them against New Reno, potentially. So, I'm going to send you guys down. Okay, maybe not. You guys come to here. And see what you can do. Oh, these are uh, actually close air support planes, so... Nice. Do as much... Get as much air speed as we can. Wow, this is really... This has really not made me happy. <laughs> oh, just trying to play fair screwed me up so much. Why? Why? Hmm. Let's go with Eduardo. That'd be good. Turn about his fair play. Well, hopefully we can still get the stuff done here. Still get to the National Spear, hopefully. Contact other gangs. Let's do that one. So while we are free of Vault City's oppression now, we are still a small group and will have difficulty standing on our own. We should probably reach out and garner some goodwill with the other gangs so they don't consider us easy targets. So do we get it? We got Vault City taxes, which is good. And that's that's really good. Yeah. So uh, we could do that. What do we have over here? Uh, research speed. Yes, please. And then that's such crap. Like oh, seriously. Yeah. You deserve that at, at the very minimum because you are supposed to be under us. You piece of garbage. Hey, that division has showed up. I just want army XP, man. That's all I want. Let's grab another general. Blazing the deafening. Blaze the deafening. He's a bruiser. Big ol' bruiser. Uh, get some more recon we could. Gunslinger, commando, division, attack, defense. Recon. I'm gonna go with more attack, because I'm thinking we need more attack. Like, it's not great. I just want you to help defend. That's all I want. I just want a bunch of army XP. So if you can defend as best we can, because we're still mobilizing a little bit, which is nice, but we'll see what happens. Alright, uh, this is weird that it's, it's shaped like this. I almost never send volunteers in Odo Blues, so. I'm not sure why I can't see their... Oh, it's... There we go, it's M. I clicked on M by accident. My bad. Get over there. Oh, don't lose, don't lose. I want to get in there. Or right, actually, are you fighting them over there? Can you actually help them out? Of course, we have minus 50% attack still, but whatever. That's just us. Uh, anything else here? No, not really. Cool. Good job, guys. These guys are still attacking like crazy. NCR, please don't go too crazy. I mean, if you attack here, you'll probably do okay. There you go. Get some more army XP. Because pale fighters... Do we have anything else around here? No, we can throw the dogs on. We got them riders or these people. Throwing the dogs. That'll be good for them. Getting probably, hopefully, slightly more air XP. Hopefully. Hopefully. Yeah. 80 is not looking good, which is fine with me. Liberated Vault City. They ditched us. They joined New Reno, which made them even more difficult to try to kill later on. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. We could get more resource extraction. We might as well do that now. Steam powered extraction would be good. Well, actually, if you want to, you can help out right there and kill it. Eh, never mind, they, they won. I don't think these guys are winning overall. Do we get any another airbase here? Doesn't look like it yet. Hey, lost those bunkers, nice. You can help out right there, probably. It's not much more army XP, but, you know, I'll take it. The quiet ones. The quiet, quiet ones. So we'll go right there. That should help out. Actually, how much manpower does each side have? You guys have... Not much. Well, you guys have way more. Way more. New Victoria declared one broken ghost. Well, good for them. Hope this guy's learning something. Stim packs are very nice. Better trained doggos. Yes. Yes. Up out right here immediately. As we're waiting to go to war with the 80s. Yeah. Actually, we do have anti tank on there, guys. So, we have a little bit of piercing. Not much. Contact other gangs. We shall do passage for the 80s. Eh, now. Nah. Uh, well, yeah. The uh, future fifth family. As far as we can tell, the Yakuza have tried to become the fifth family of the new Reno since basically forever, but the four existing ones have stopped them so far. While we can't help them with that directly, we can do so indirectly with giving them the option to smuggle whatever they want into and outside of re new Reno. It only requires a bit of work on our part to dig some covert tunnels into the disused pre-war sewer system of the city. And if we're good at one thing, it's digging tunnels. Which, obviously, this does nothing for us, but I don't really care. I just want to get through it and then get to the bottom one. Capture the Lost Bunker. Good job. Oh, actually... Good job encircling stuff there. Glenn! 
Vil. Oh, are we the last ones attacking here? Oh, we got we got them off. Or I guess everyone else did. Slave escape from New Reno. Uh, freedom's the right of every Westlander. Hopefully they don't kill us off. Please don't kill me off. Please. You don't have caps. You want to do that. Focus on the internal sphere. We good. Uh, you know what? We could start focusing on this since we have no no more places to core for now. Power broker, just not worth it. Just not worth it. Into war industrial is limited factories. How many factories do we have? Because I'm building up a lot of forts, like around the entire area here. Like anywhere we have border, we gotta build up forts. So. Loads of forts. Lots and lots and lots and lots of forts. So gotta do this one too, so. I'm gonna go and do Westland Survivalism training, stuff like that, so that'd be good. There you go, Lost House Bunker was recaptured. Well, that's not good. Or no, maybe, yeah, it was, I think. Cool, we got involved. Help take him out. Take out that division too. Yeah, I almost never send volunteers to anyone. So, if we can take out the 80s, great. Help take those guys out. At least take a little portion of their territory. At least a little bit. Like, what do we have here? Like, I want to take all of Nevada if we can. Like, the parts that we can actually get to. So that'll be good. Uh, maybe take a little part up here as well. Maybe this part of Utah. If the White Legs demand that we hand over the territory, I'll be fine with that. I don't really care, to be honest with you. I really don't care about that part. You guys come over here. You're doing a great job. Since we got involved, we started winning. Coincidence? I think not. Oh, you can go even higher then, huh? Oh, well, well, we're out of cast anyway, so actually... I gave up half of the factories just to do this. Jesus Christ. Such a dumb idea. Help them out right here. That'll be good. I don't want to use up all my political power right now, but... Mercenary training instructors? Why not? Even slightly more organization would be nice. Okay, we can go to war for Oasis. That's cool. We might as well start getting involved. Ooh, yeah, we might as well. Even though our attack isn't great, we still might as well do it. There you go. Because these guys are not looking great now. I'm actually going to take one of you guys to go right there. Cut them off if you can. Oh, they found us. Heaven's Gate Clear One. Hi, Chapel. Cool. Go ahead, go ahead. Automation, awesome. Maybe we'll grab some. No, not that. What does we want? Uh, operational security, volatile explosives. I get volatile explosives because we can. Cool, they're doing a good job so far. And we've done like, what, 2%? Like milk? Wow. We killed off 180. We've lost 32. It is what it is. Take them out. Cool. Carl, in your back. Cool. Come back over. Hey, just kind of join the army. Just join the army. That's all you have to do. Just join the army. So we'll take a little bit here and there. Not too much, but enough. And actually, we're going to go to war with Eastport next. Complicated circuitry. And then i got to start saving up some political power, because, oh my goodness, this is not going to be good. Because we got to core, 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 as fast as possible. Go straight for Wendover if you can. Uh, yeah, you guys keep going. Do a good job, do a good job. 0.96 a day because of stability. All right, so obviously we're going to give most of this to the White Legs. It doesn't make any sense for us to take most of this, or a good chunk of this anyways. So let's get a little more score. And, yeah. Obviously, it looks like we're, we're probably going to have to kill off the White Legs to get enough territory for us so we can form the state of Nevada, which would be good. Uh, I think I deserve at least Oasis. No, we'll take this, too. And we'll give everything else to the White Legs because I think... It just makes sense for them. They did most of this, so. Cool. Oh, that's way too much score. My bad. Oh, went over. It's a big score. Actually, taking Ruby Valley Refuge would not have been bad, actually, probably, but whatever. Yeah, that's, that's a lot of score. Holy crud. As well as New Hammond? Jesus. How much score? 500 some? Jesus. So give me just one moment, please. And we'll get through this fairly, fairly quickly. So hopefully the White Legs don't go to war with us. We'll go to war with Eastport, take over their stuff, core as much as we possibly can. 
and then maybe go to war with Murtaugh. It depends if the Troll Warren do that as well. So. Yeah, that should be good enough. There you go. Wait, is there another... Oh, I forgot about that. There you go. There we go. Cool. That is fine with me. This is honestly looking a little disgusting, but whatever. Uh, you guys do that. You guys do that. And then you guys do that. Even though, actually, I'm going to pull you back out. Boom. 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 Future Fifth Family. Great. And what you'll do... Passage for the 80s. A neighboring raider gang that calls themselves the 80s are doing a regular pilgrimage across old I-80, which coincidentally does directly go through the Carlton Tunnel. They have not been able to complete a large part of the journey since the tunnel collapsed during the war and only became recently passable again after we cleared it. We could allow them free and safe passage through, though. This should this should make them at least somewhat happy, maybe even get something out of the deal. Raiding bros? <laughs> well, whatever. We'll do whatever we can to make things work. But let's go ahead and build up some more civilian factories there, and then maybe some more of that. And as well as build more and more and more uh, forts, because we're going to need them. Jesus Christ. Happy 2280, though, my friends. Let's get some more construction speed. And actually, resistance. How is that looking? Well, not bad. Not great. It is what it is. And what do we have over here? Planes. Oh, 21. 21 planes. Not bad. Not bad, not bad, not bad. How about so we can get maybe a little bit more air XP? That'd be kind of nice. If you don't enter the ca Tiger's Cave, you can't catch its cub. This morning, we got a shipment from a caravan company said that the sender wanted to remain anonymous, though based on the content, it is kind of obvious who it is from. Seeing your guests to the Yakuza territories was appreciated. While we would have appreciated a more personal meeting, this is too fine, too. What did they send us? A few crates full of those nifty-looking swords they make. Cool. I'm fine with that. Do we have enough supplies for everything here? Except for, uh, Cass. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna come back down here and hopefully do a good job. Actually, yeah, I'll come down here to the southern part here. That'll be good. All right, Blaze the Deafening. Hopefully, you can do a good job as well. Got to get about to get paid soon. Help all the settlements immediately. Purebred mutts, and get some more anti tank because we'll, we'll definitely need that. And even though we should focus more on infantry stuff, like I completely ignored that for now, so that's probably not good to do. I want at least two full lines of civilian factories too. So, uh, wow. You guys, you must be out of manpower. You must be. You know what? I, I'm not going to deal with this, okay? Like, this, I don't want to do this, but I'm just going to take this territory. I'm not going to deal with this type of crap. Like, I don't mind if I have to core this again, but that was such a waste of time that we had to do. I'm just taking it. I'm not, I'm not going to deal with that, no. You can't just force me to go to war with you. After I core the territory of Vault City, they, they join, they leave us, even though we puppeted them, they leave us, join the other alliance, just to go to war with us, to take the territory they want, that was such a waste, man, this focus tree is, it's gotten me all worked up several different ways, I don't mind spending, uh, political power again, to like, core this area, because it's, 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 good, it's a good area, it's a good area, but, I'm sorry, man, I, 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 I think I'm, I'm okay and justified, and justified in retaking this territory, because, if I knew that we wouldn't be able to do this, like, do Vulcan Calling, even if we didn't puppet them, like, I would have done it already, just taking the ter territory back. Because we, we won fair and square. Like, come on, I'm not going to fight a second war with you after you leave us, and then you join en potential enemies. That's not cool. Uh, there's just, no, no, no. But anyways, second time around, let's go core this again. Why not? Even though I really do want to core this territory, so. We'll... We'll get through this. At least I'll get through this, hopefully. Woo! But that does not make me not want to continue or stop playing this campaign. Because we will do whatever we can to do well here. Passage for the 80s, great, and back to raiding. So, our position is secure. There are two, no immediate threats on the horizon. Time to have a look at what other people have, have and check if they would be willing to part with it, one way or another. Cool. And I'll grab some grenade rifles. No, let's go back over here. Let's grab some... I think someone did recommend I use basic laser weaponry, so... You know, that is kind of bright when you shoot stuff like this. Let's do that anyways. Let's see. Someone also recommended it from the yesterday's comments that I play as a Mojave Brotherhood of Steel. And whenever the Old World Blues update for 3.0 comes out, so... Mojave Brotherhood, I played as them once. Oh, the Sky, Sky Reavers are looking really nice. But yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll get there. we'll get there eventually. Like, I plan on playing a lot of different nations, so... The Wheel Mother arrives. Oh, we need more infantry armor. Oh, boy. 
So do that, lower that by one. Oh, I don't want to lower planes, so. Apparently, the given, giving the 80s free access to the Carlin Tunnel made them way happier than we anticipated. Earlier this morning, the sudden roaring of machines close to the gates of one of our outposts made the inhabitants think that they were about to be attacked. But it turns out the 80s decided to return our favor. A whole procession of bikes was awaiting an audience with our leader, led by a woman calling herself the Wheel Mother. Apparently, she is a big deal with them, so we should probably treat her with respect. She's willing to grant us a gift in the form of a bunch of fully equipped bike riding bands. This seems like a good deal. On the other hand, the Wheel Mother could probably help us a lot with building our own bikes. Maybe we could ask her to say politely, of course. Uh... Divisions. Oh, the wheel mother. We have her down here. Like, is she good? Eh, we're not really using motorized. I think we could always use more people. Let's get that one. That'll be good. Uh, let's go and actually. What do you look like? Twelve. Your wheel. Hmm. Whatever. Uh, just do pale fighters. There you go. And everyone here should be pale fighters. There we go. If we need to train, go right ahead. No worries. We got more stability though. Probably because world tension went up to 100 percent. Probably. So, so at this point, we can't really spend too much more political power. But what we have to do, save up political power so I can recore everything. <laughs> Why? But you know what? Once we get to the focus tree, we'll get a lot more political power. So that'll be fine with me. We still need to do power from below. I'm not sure why anyone would really choose Beowave, like for this one, to ramp up the power there. Because better uses, you get more energy still gain per energy and energy still capacity. Like the energy still gain per energy is much more important than this because you can always make more energy like I mean, maybe i understand like in the first part of the campaign where you don't have a lot of energy maybe that you might go for that one but once you can start making those purification stations or power stations and stuff like that better uses does seem like the way to go at least that's just my opinion spec ops oh i wanted to use those guys yeah i did i did want to make some spec ops so let's make sure uh, yeah let's go and do that wait but hold what power why do I get power armor demo teams? Oh, it's just because we did, we did... We haven't unlocked power armor, but we do have dynamite unlocked, so... Huh. Okay, well, you know, I'll be honest, this is probably one of the wonkiest campaigns I've played to date, so... It is what it is. But we can still enjoy it for what it is. Ooh, how's Mexico doing? Oh, that is some... Those are some big white legs. That's a big lone tree. I'm surprised that Murtaugh reformers have not been killed off by the troll war, because they're looking pretty good, too. Uh, let's come over here. Let's grab some more... Rapid prototyping, and then maybe some more extraction. That'd probably be pretty good. Because we're missing minus three, which would not be very good. New California Republic is looking great. And as Kazo's Legion is trying to kill off the dam... Can I send volunteers to the dam busters? Oh, I can't. Come on, man. Why not? Oh, the poor Canaanites. And please let us go to war. But unfortunately, I will be right back. All right, my apologies about that, but I was hungry and went to go get a bite to eat. But now we're done with back to raiding, in which we can now do below, or power from below. After entering the plant, it was remarkably easy to get it up and running again. Most of the time was actually spent on plugging our underground power grid into it. We get three more energy. Okay. Cool. Cool. But yeah, uh, let's see. Eastport will die. Then after that, it's either the wide legs, which we will not be able to take out. Or Nurino, which we will not be able to take out. Maybe the Murtaugh reforms. What are the Troll Warren up to? Like, preparing for war? Um, preparing for war. Where is that? I assume it'd be down here. Final threat. Mariposa are born. War for supremacy. Preparing. Oh, there it is. <coughs> mm -hmm. Myler converts. Huh. All right, cool. We gotta save our political power up like normal. And how much longer must we wait? Merely 10 days. Not bad. Looks like they do have at least one motorized division, so that's not good. And you're almost done there, too, which is good. And, come on. 99. Good. Now we're ready to go. And we got the justification done as well. Awesome. Now, when can we do this? I'm going to recore this stuff. 59. We got 43. We got fast compliance gain, though, which is nice. All right, let's go see if we can take these guys out. Army 1, Army 4. Do we have any more gliders? Yes, we do. That's going to be good and very useful. I'll cut you guys down in half, because one of you guys are going here. And the other group is going to go right here. 3, 2. We should do okay by ourselves, and go ahead. Have we tried... Can we actually... Okay. Hey, the NCR Rangers won't help us out? Yeah. Okay, so even... Okay, so we can attack with overwhelming forces. Obviously, the minus 50% attack doesn't hurt us too much, but... we well, you still gotta keep that in mind. 
And now we're going to be taking more territory, which means we're going to have more resistance, which means we got to put down resistance more, 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 more. So we'll see what happens. Air superiority is not bad. 48 air XP. Keep them in their place. Nannies. Nannies. Cool. Basically, the weaponry is great. Oh, my bad. Let's come back over here to, for, for more breakthrough, because even though we have minus 50% attack, losing breakthrough is still very not good. Hey, they showed up. Great. We got it. Charlestone. If we can do that, that'd be awesome. They threw another division, a couple more divisions in there. But we can pierce them, so it doesn't really matter too much. Come on, get in there before they can. Oh, come on, man. Come on. Nice. Can you help out right there with the attack? Perhaps, maybe, maybe not. Come on. Force the attack. Push them out. They have three divisions. Get through another motorized power from below, and we'll go ahead and do better uses. We currently have more enough power with just a three dermal plant being plugged into our system. In fact, the plant literally produces more than we can currently use, but we can use this facility to efficiently charge up energy cells to use as batteries for weapons and other equipment. Which would be great. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Attack him here, too. Force it. Oh, and okay, we won. Cool. Hey, at least we got him under us. But now it's going to take even more to put them down. Okay, white legs, you're looking a little scary there, not gonna lie. White claws, huh? 14,000 man for Jesus Christ. Okay. Well, it's either the Murtaugh folk, or the Troll Warren. Because I'm sure the Troll Warren have claims on this territory, don't they? Uh, unwilling gatherers. Decimate the dancers. Territory disputes decisions for the Crimson Acolytes' co former core territories, which they have not done. Or something, I'm not really sure. I don't mind attacking them, but we need more manpower before we can do anything else, as well as more political power. And there goes High Chapel, too. So, Cool. Now, let me double check. Let's see. Ooh, let's look at resistance first. Alright, so it's... Ah, oh, look! It's going down for the 80s. That's good. My apologies. My cat was outside my door. Or just outside my room. Just meowing. Lovely for fun. I don't know. Because he can. 58, 58, 70, 70, 70. Cool, not bad. Rapid prototyping is awesome. Grab some more electrical extraction. That'd be good. And we'll grab some more radio because we can, as well as some encryption. Postcode modulations. Why not? So we got all this political power. And let's continue building ourselves up Battle Mountain. We, I really built up the infrastructure here very nicely. That's very good for us. I should probably build up more infrastructure here as well. Uh, circuitry is going to be pretty important, so I'll do that first. It's so disappointing that they just had to rebel against us. So disappointing. We're still mobilizing. We still are somehow, but that's good with us. That's fine with me. Fine with me. Can we train any more? Maybe we should get some more support equipment, because that could be very, very beneficial. Uh, how are our gun stockpiles? Infantry armor is looking very bad. Uh, ooh, that is not good. If that's the case, I'm going to lower you to two and two. That'd be fine. Go up to 10 for now. Yeah, that is not bueno. But regardless, even if we don't have enough, we still get more compliance. I hope. Yeah, 0 0.3. Then goes up to 0 0.6. 2 0.9. So that's still actually very, very good. And resistance is dropping quite quickly, so. Even though, maybe not eSport. Yeah, it's still going up in eSport. 0 0.8, 0 0.2, 0 0.5. Good stuff. Uh, minus 1.6. Okay, maybe it's going down slowly more and more. Yeah, by two a day, maybe. Hey, that's actually 20 more. Nice. Better use is great. And we can do tunnel communications. Over the decades, stuck underground, our tunnel network has become ra rather far-reaching. One, one thing we figured out was that certain noises carried really through the tunnels. So we devised a system to communicate through these noises. And while those same noises won't carry as far above ground, no one else but us will understand the message, which could prove useful in certain situations. Your bonus to primitive radio, whatever, but 25% more encryption will be very nice to have. And we still have 40 factories. Cool. Postcode modifications. Awesome. Grab decryption. Great. Oz is coming along. 28%. 59. It's not bad. We just gotta get this done as fast as possible. Actually, we could probably go ahead and just straight up core again Vault City. So that'd be okay with me. Yeah. Oh, Heaven's Gate beat these guys up too. Yeah, I wanna go to war, but we gotta save save ourselves for now. Just we don't have the infantry armor for it. We gotta wait. We've gotta, 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 gotta wait. Oh, so we, did we finish that stuff already? 100%? Nice. That was, that was really, really fast. Um, hmm. 
because we could use more military factories, so I'm going to put it right there first. Since you're almost done, you might as well do that too. Oh, actually, hold on. Since we have these, we don't need these anymore then. There we go. That'll be nice. Build up all the roads. We got quite a bit of political power. Veteran training instructors. Eh, might as well. We can spend just a little bit of it. That's fine. Side channel attack is great. We're almost done with this entire part of the research tree. Grab some industrial fertilizer. Yes, please. We could only get 68 people a month. Okay, that was 33, but now 68. Guerrilla tactics are nice. Let's go ahead and grab some more additional plating so we get harder. We lose some speed, but that's okay. We can only have 1.19. White claws are clear worn. Okay, dead horses. No longer white legs. White claws. Dominion over Utah. Ooh. Oh, look at that. So actually, we were smart. And this is still part of Nevada, not Utah. So they probably won't want to go to war with us. And they go to war on the crazy horns. Oh, going to try to fight the White Claws is going to be difficult. Oh, man. Um, can we join the NCR's faction? That would actually be really good if, we, good if we could. And we have the King Zheng Lu over here. Huh. Okay. Why not? Why not? Yeah, keep getting more military factors. That's looking so nice. Oh, less than 60. Yes. Yes. We're so close. Right. Pain to man assume faction leadership of the Free States Collective. Ah, just go and do this one. Why not? Hurts our training time, but that's fine with me. Whatever. Tone of communications. And then we shall do Spec Ops training manual. The first entry is made up of some strange characters. No one... No one... Uh, could understand. The rest is a normal if someone broke in English. This raises some questions regarding our ancestors. But disregarding that, while some of it is a bit hard to understand due to the poor English, it sort of contains a lot of good information regarding military tactics and operations. Actually, that means we still have to kill off the Desert Rangers. Oh, this is going to suck. This is really going to suck. But we shall do well no matter what. We must push forward. Cool. Can we recore Vault City? So I, I think here's the game plan. After, once we get enough of this places cored, we get through all the focuses first. We'll take up Murtaugh, take all the territory, core as much as we can, you know, whatever that, however we do that. Uh, go ahead and, oh, that's actually not bad to core. Let's core this, because we get some factories. Ooh, actually, how close is Vault City? Oh, they're super close, though. Uh, just go it. Oh, this is actually pretty good to core. Nice, look at that manpower now. Beautiful. Uh, let's go and do this. Get to the radar, because we might as well. So, we'll take up Murtaugh Reformers. Then we'll actually defend as best as we possibly can and defeat Nurino. After that, then we'll probably go to war with the White Claws and then finish off New California, New California Republic. Because we need, we still need this part of the Rangers. Actually, we'll save these guys for last because we still need to take out probably parts of Mojave as well as the Sky Reavers. So we still have quite a campaign to get through. So uh, that'd be good. 15 15. Not bad. Hey, one. Not bad, not bad. I like it. I like it a lot. Get that done. So we get some more factories done here. Actually, you know what? I think we're good right there already. That'd be fine. Additional plating? Great. And you know what? Just go and get close quarter tactics. Even more suppression. Love it. So now we might have enough already for riot gear and enforcer stuff. Minus 89. Goes down by 14 or goes actually up by 14. That'd be nice. Goes up by 15. Great, great, great. And next up we'll core Vault City. Because actually this is a really good core in this area. Look, look how many factors we have. It was cored at once. Like, when I released Vault City, we lost, like I said earlier, almost half of our factories. So, coring this once again will definitely help us out. Come on, please, please, please. Oh, I could core these other places again, probably like Golconda, but it, it wouldn't really matter much to me right now. Uh, industrial fertilizer, great. Uh, let's grab some more dedicated equipment. Very nice. Spec Ops Field Training Manual. After that, a good defense is probably pretty good to do as well. We are our few in number. We can't afford to lose too many people. Something that can stop a bullet, a spear, or a bite from some unnecessary large lizard will lower our our losses significantly, which will be a very good thing to do. So we get a bonus for Special Forces equipment. Good stuff. Always nice. I'm kind of just waiting for the time to go on so we can get this the last focus done so we can get through this one better. I'll be honest, like even though we're pretty much maxed out of manpower, I think we're still doing pretty darn well, so, I mean, obviously going down conventional warfare and getting that 5% bonus really does help out. What do we have? Like, this is the max you can get, probably. We've got subterranean farms, which is great, face of sun, adequate living quarters, raider recruitment 5% from our land doctrine, settlement protection, civilian draft, no, well, raider recruitment is from something else. Oh, it's from this guy. Yeah. Raider recruiter. So that's actually really good, as well as we did plus 20% non-core manpower. 
plus another 6% non-core manpower. So actually, manpower, we're doing okay. Not great, not great. But we're doing okay on manpower. For now. Because we're, we're going to be... Because we're done mobilizing. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, that's not good. Close quarters, tr combat training. Go ahead and grab some common energy weaponry, too. That'd be good. Oh, uh, let's see. Ooh, there goes... Oh, well, Canyon Exile. For the love of God, I hope they go to war with the Legion or something. I need them to kill, like, fight. Have a disastrous war against someone else so we can take them out much more easily. I hope they can do that. And we have Cord Vault City once again. Finally. Oh, my goodness. Go and build up some more civilian factories there. That'd be good. But, Jesus, that's just... I don't know. Just... Ugh. Why? Oh, well, we got enough infantry armor. Let's go ahead and just find these guys if we can eventually. Oh, no. This is why I don't want to just find them. Look at that. While we were busy coring our own stuff, or taking out Vault City and doing that stuff again, this is what I was worried about. Northern Guardians have a thousand manpower, actually. Damn, Busters, there goes Heaven's Gate. They're out of manpower, of course. Uh, advanced tools. Let's grab some of this, because we can. Flexible designs are nice. And now we're back up to 63 factories. That is not bad. Good. Not bad. Uh, go ahead and make it at least one for now. Siege of Hidden Valley. Wait, what? Must have been a bloodbath. Oh, there goes a Mojave chapter, that's right. Cool. Are you guys still fighting over here? No, they actually beat... They took out the dam. Oh, man. Oh, hello. New Victoria is here. Oh, they're fighting... Oh, the Washington Brotherhood. I see. You know what? If the Joe Warren end up fighting Murtaugh Reformers, I might do it the exact same thing at the exact same time for the Reformers here. Ten days, we got plenty of time then. So, if they go to war with the Murtaugh Reformers, they still might be able to take out the Reformers, but then the Troll Warren still might die to Washington Brotherhood. Maybe? Maybe, uh, Land Doctrine? We're pretty much done with the Land Doctrine. Air stuff. Let's grab some agility and max speed. That'd be good. I mean, I'm loading the manpower now. But this is it. This is literally it. The only way we get more manpower is by coring stuff. So, not good. Especially if we have a massive war against these guys, which is going to be a pain in the butt. But now that we got Vault City back, basically, because I just basically annexed them. We gotta do this, 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 this. And double for that, just because that's going to get hit really harshly. So, you know what? Let's go ahead and do this. I could, you know what? Let's do this first. We have the Militia Divisions. Someone recommended I do this, like, before. Make this as big as possible. So we can get as much in here as possible when we can uh, get stuff done, I guess. I don't know. Do that. Go on out. So now we'll do this. The below is ours. We could open the tunnels to the people up from the above, but we won't. We have to build them with our own hands, and we fought for them. Uh, they sheltered us during the long dark, and they will shelter us through the future hardships. They are ours. Spawns four militia groups scattered around your lands. Hopefully we didn't waste army XP there, but I have a feeling we did. <laughs> I have a really good feeling that we did. After this, we're going to grab, uh, let's see, how much recon do we have on our pale fighters? Five, that's actually not bad. So we might not need recon. I might instead choose something else. Maybe saws. You know what? Maybe I'll go for saws. I almost never go for saws. Because I don't find them super, super useful. Well, maybe I'll use them. Should I use saws? What else do we have? We have doggos, which I want to use. Probably doggos. we got rocket launchers already. Saws are very useful. Or somewhat useful. We don't need recon because we already have recon. Even though getting more recon is always beneficial. We have logistic companies, which is... Eh, we don't really need them, probably. And maintenance companies... Eh, 10% more equipment, equipment capture ratio. That's okay. Should I use saws? Let me know. Because that'll help us... Actually, quite a bit on defense. Saws are really good on defense. Attacking, not so much, but on defense, not bad. Let's grab some grenade rifles, because we have to pr actually produce those. So there you go. 15, 15, 13, not bad. Just build, 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 build. The more you build, the better you can get. How about settlements? Yes. Send it some more pro you know, prospectors. Troll warrant. There we go. Murtaugh, yes. They are winning against these guys over there, so... I'm not really sure if I should really help out now over here and grab some more organization first. I don't want to help out and fight Murtaugh Reformers yet. I want to see the trolls die. I really do. Oh, don't let them push in. Please don't let them push in. Because they want to take all the Acolytes territory. Which would be nice to have, but... Oh, God. Are these all core territory? Oh, God. Shoshone as well. They might go to war with the Heaven's Gate peoples. What? Oh, my Oh my goodness. They have a claim on Twin Falls. Okay. Oh, and the White Legs have a claim on... Oh. Oh, man. We are caught between a rock and a hard place right now. So badly. 
Actually, can I help out the Washington Brotherhood? No. Can I help out Port Mall? No. Can I send out these guys? Yes. And I can still justify on them? Alright, you know what? We'll try that. Why not? I'm going to send volunteers to you, and then I'm going to kill you off. Uh, this is some weird chess game we're playing. I swear to God, man. I, s I swear. Uh, cool. How many planes can we send them? 15. Oh, well, 15, huh? Well, that kind of sucks. There you go. Good luck. Uh, yeah, you actually don't have enough range. Hmm. Well, that sucks. Uh, is there any airbase up there at all? White Clouds. Clear. Oh, that's not even really a good airbase, because you have zero out of... Jesus Christ, guys, come on. <laughs> ah! And the White Legs are good. Oh, my gosh. Gosh? You guys go like those guys. Oh, so White Claws have... Uh, they must have done the one where they take all of Utah. Reject Legion's coins? Yeah, okay, so they, they did Dominion over Utah. That's fine. Ooh. Below is ours. Good, 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 good. And let them come. Which will be great for 20% more division on, on core territory. Did anyone dare to strike at us in our element? Will you only say to come at us and be prepared to fail? And we got some more divisions. Throw. Oh, yeah. So are these... Hey, they, the person who was correct, that person was correct, stating that if I make the militia division bigger, we get all this extra stuff, which is awesome, awesome, awesome. I'm going to throw you over here, but I'm not going to use you. I'm just going to go ahead and convert you to Pale Fighters so we can get that. We will gain 500 manpower, 80 infantry equipment, and 60 dogs. Was it worth using all that army XP? Uh, maybe? I guess, I guess why not. So, let's go and do that. That was actually kind of worth it, in my opinion, then. And throw them all right there. That's fine. Cool. That was awesome. That was actually really, really awesome. And... Do we have our divisions here? Yes, we do. Murta, please don't die. Who are you going to be led by? Someone new. Oh, wait, wait. I should not have done that yet. We wanted to get more defense for this guy, but whatever. Uh, how about right here, then? See what we can do. And then maybe we'll call it an episode. Because now we are doing Let Them Come, which is great. Common Energy Weaponry. We're not using Scout Kit yet, so... Hmm... Let's get some more doggo stuff. I love the doggos. Doggos are good. Probably the. I just hired you. How did you fall ill? Oh my goodness, troll warm. Please don't. Please don't win. Please don't win. Please don't win. Construction repair. Oh, they're out of manpower almost. But the Washington Brotherhood has enough. Port Mall does not. You guys have a little bit, so we'll see what happens. If we can help stand up against some mutants, so be it. That'd be awesome. Uh, you fought right there since you're. Probably going to have to help out Bly, so. Uh, do you have any upgrades? Idiot Savant. Attack. Ninja. We get more attack, because we're using infantry still here, so. Cool. Hold out for now. We don't want to get these guys killed off. We will get more army XP, because that's always good to get more, but. Get a hold off. Let's see. Can we cover anything else here in Bolt City territory? Gecko. I've got to do Gecko just because of all those factories. we got two more factories. Actually, five more. One, two, three, some. Let's grab some. Oh, God, that's a really terrible organ uh, infrastructure, but that's fine. Uh, grab some offensive armament as well. We actually have enough air XP for that. Nice. That's actually really good. Oh, come on, Troll Warren. Oh, they're, being, they're getting beaten back. That's good. That's good. How's the airbase looking? Did they repair it yet? No, they didn't. Of course they wouldn't. Why would they? O oh, Divisions. O oh, Murta. Cool. Context is looking good. Trying to put ourselves in the best possible position. Oh boy. We can pierce them. We're kind of entrenched. We're fighting with melee stuff. Oh boy, it's not going to be good. Oh, well, oh mm, we were looking okay there for a second, but now we're looking... Mm, we're probably not going to win this battle. We're going to treat that way. Don't get overran. For the love of God, don't get overran. Whew, okay. Ooh, grenade rifles. Nice. I love grenade rifles. Let's grab some more Simpax auto injectors. I love auto injectors. I love injection. Well, not really. That sounds terrifying. All right then. This is dangerous to do this, but we'll try it. I just want to defend more. Hey, the Desert Rangers have shown up. Hold. Oh boy. All right, you're cheap. We're gonna sacrifice those divisions. 
But the Washington Brotherhood, uh, it's still quite the tussle around here. Oh, man, the Desert Rangers already got encircled. How? How? <laughs> Why? Man, these enemies are tough. Some tough cookies. Hey, maybe they actually repaired stuff finally. All right, let's increase it by 30. Cool. Oh, hold on. Hold on. New Victoria. Whoa. Good job, New Victoria. Good job with that. Please attack me. Contact loss. And add the descent. Some of our scavengers went missing. We can't raise them. And we only have a message with their last known location. It is your call whether we try to rescue them. Of course we're going to try to rescue them. Are you kidding me? And, of course we're going to rescue them. Are you crazy? Why would we not? We found the expedition. Great. Great, 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 great. More factories means more planes. More planes. It's got equipment. So, let's do this. We made these 20 combat with already. Cams. Good. And we're almost there to get the next level. Let them come. Yeah, we're almost there. And I think that's going to be it for the focus tree. So, uh, I think... Ooh, what are we going to do? You know, let's keep playing. We're going to just get as much of the political power as possible here from this stuff. So, we just kind of have to do that. We definitely have to court this as well. And I'm going to court Golconda as well. Because it'll help us defend against New Reno. In which, next episode, we'll probably go to war with Murta, maybe? I just hope the Troll Warren... The Troll Warren are coming back. Even more vicious. But they're out of manpower. Much like the Washington Brotherhood. Much like everyone else here. Everyone's out of manpower. God dang it. Mm, I could go to war with these guys. That would only make things worse, though. Mm. It's not good. Hey, it look, looks like they're suffering from attrition, though. That's good. How much, uh, what is their infantry stockpile like, though? Do we know? Platoon training? Oh, that's pretty good. It's not bad, actually. They got some good stuff. But let's finish off with this. And one more thing. Go and we'll and grab Pioneer Kids. So... I said at the end of the last episode that we had an intelligence agency name, and we're going to call it, as someone suggested, the... Uh, I'll just call it Night Guard. Because someone recommended that name, and we shall choose... What does what it say nighttime? Sunglasses? That, are those sunglasses? No. Uh, what says nighttime around here? Eagle? Uh, let's maybe choose that one, just because we can. Cool! But I hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. It, I know it was really, really wonky, but we've kind of come back and putting ourselves in a good position. If you like the video, consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow when we all might take out the reformers, Murtaugh reformers, but we'll see what happens. Thanks for watching, have a great rest of your day.